It's time now for Hot Headlines, and the countdown is over, people. Over. Taylor Swift's newest single is hot, and it's here. Okay. Are you ready for it? Let's do it. Take a listen. Cause the players gonna play, 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 play. That's not catchy or anything. I was going to say, at least it's catchy. <laughs> right? <laughs> That'll be it in your head for the rest of, something, of the day. reminds me of something, but I can't think of what it is. <laughs> well, anyway, she performed Shake It Off for the first time. And why not do it Do it up big, right? Oh. It was um, on top of the Empire State Building during a live web stream on Yahoo. Huh. She oh. says the song is simply about ignoring your haters and staying true to yourself. Word, Taylor Swift. She then revealed her new album called 1989. will hit shelves at the end of October. Hmm. I think that's probably the year she was born. Take that, haters. Haters gonna hate, haters hate, gonna hate, 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 hate. She's just gonna shake, 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 shake it, it off. off. There you go. Easy yeah. enough. I, uh, Marshall, I hope you're ready. I'm, I'm the bearer of bad news this morning. Well, why? Well, there's, um, there's word that One Direction is breaking up. Oh, heavens, whatever shall we do? At I'm least, sad. I mean... Wait, what? I'm sad about this. Really? You are not. I don't know. I don't know one song they sing. I, I have... Uh, yeah, I got nothing. We're not the, the generation, word, though, you guys. I mean, it could be a reliable story. It's coming from Wait, Simon take Cowell. A, take a listen. Is this them? This is them. Yeah. Yeah, I like this song. Oh, in a recent, know this. In a recent yeah. interview with a, uh, a, a, some newspaper, Simon Cowell gave the band's prognosis. He says, you know, bands don't stay together forever. Um, hello, Rolling Stones. He estimates they're only going to make two more albums together. By the way, no, One Direction is yeah, not direction. the same. The Rolling Stones was. were not a boy band. Right. <laughs> Although Backstreet Boys are, you oh, know, still maybe they'll reunite then. They're in the middle of a new album right now. They're making a new album, and Simon Cowell's already saying, eh, they're not going to last forever. He says that some of the boys will go solo after the breakup, and ironically, I bet he's going to manage them. Does that he manage shock, them now? It? Yes. One Direction is a Simon Cowell creation. Oh, Didn't so that it'd be better for them to break up because then he can five. have yeah. many more money. Options. Spread and yeah. conquer. Many more monies. Many more monies. Many more yeah. monies. And KOTB is still around, aren't they? Yes. Kind of, sort of, a little you bit. You guys, bit. you're naming bands that are around because they get back together when they need cashola. Well, yeah. But not all of them can get back together and make cashola. Right. True. Go with what works. Go yeah. with what works. We're getting ready for fall out there, and Christina Aguilera is still thinking about summer rain. Uh, uh huh. That's what she's going to name her new child. The baby girl uh -huh. born in Los Angeles on Saturday. The singer tweeted out, So proud to welcome our beautiful daughter, Summer Rain Rutler, into the world. Ms. Aguilera is uh, engaged to Matt Rutler. She also has a six-year-old uh, six with her ex-husband, Jordan Bratman. A son. A What's son. his name? I don't know. Summer Rain. Summer Rain. Hmm. You know that song I love? Isn't that the... Never mind. What? what? I was thinking of something else. I know what you were thinking of. Yeah, it don't was like say it. some kind of a hygiene product. <laughs> I'm just saying, no, it's, what came, no, no, it's word no, association, no, and that's no. unfortunately where I went. <laughs> All I thought of that song. Dun 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 dun. Africa, Toto. Yes. Because she saw took the rain sound. Now you're taking me back to my high school band days because we played that. What instrument did you play? At that point, I was on the xylophone. Oh, you could do. Yes, you were on the xylophone. Nice. Ripping it up. Saxophone to xylophone. Okay. Well, they say after years of marriage, you and your spouse kind of become more like. Yeah. But one celeb is. Now looking like her husband. Looking. Looking? Nicole Kidman was spotted on the set of her new movie, The Family Fang, with Jason Bateman and Christopher Walken. And she's sporting a do that's uh, oddly similar to husband Keith Urban. Look at Interesting. that. Interesting. It is. Oh, my gosh. They, they do kind of look like twins, don't they? Maybe they went to a salon with, like, a BOGO special or something. Buy one, get one? Yeah. I don't know. I mean, he has much more prominent highlights. Yeah. <laughs> Do you think that? <laughs> I always wonder, like, does he keep like a flat also iron? Also, probably courtesy of Simon Cowell, yes. but that's a whole right? separate. They were just trying to t like throw people off and make it look like you know he's like at a food truck kissing himself, like just keep people guessing. No, because she's taller. You're right, she is. Oh well. Hey, coming up on Good Day Columbus, um, I just saw her 
walk in. So Pete's I'm gonna like pass freaking along. out. We have an angel in the studio this morning.